Welcome back to Sunstar Games, the place to find new strategy games and today we're kind of branching out. And this is not exactly a strategy game, this is a puzzle game. It's called Amazing Pyramids of Birth and it's kind of like if you took the Hangman game, gave it a lot of like bonuses or extra abilities and combine it with Egypt. And that's what we've got today. So let's begin. We'll start an adventure game. In the heart of the Sahara Desert, surrounded by quicksands, amazing pyramids were found. They have a story for travelers. Alright, so let's begin here. We can start our very first pyramid. So the way this works is that you have a category do down here. And we are going to have to find the right word over here. Now, each time here you click on a word, it will cost you some energy, which you have here on the left top. Nice one. And at the end... Yep. Okay, <laughs> it just keeps wanting me to do things. At the end, however much energy you have left will get converted into money. There will also be special abilities that you can see here that you're going to be able to use later. And... Um, we can use these abilities to sort of like reveal vowels or things like that. So this is uh, actually, this is the same word as it was in the other tutorial, so I'm just gonna go with cranberry. Bullseye. There's also a way to kind of, if you know the word, you can speed it up and just click here to write it down, but not yet. The tutorial kind of wants, wants us to learn that. that. Yeah, this is the energy where we talked about it. I don't remember what the second word where it was, so we're just gonna have to try. What's that? Let's try an O. Okay. Oh, lemonade! Yes, that's okay. So it's, it's, it's the same as it was in the first time. I remember the first time I was like, what is that? Or it took me a little while. It's not super intuitive for me, at least. But you know, we got. Oh, US states. Oh, this was, uh, this was Indiana. I played this like two days ago, so... Oh! Clicked on a B instead of A. So I kind of remember some of these. So obviously this is a tutorial online, so that's why it's the same. Later on it's going to be randomized, so don't worry about that. Uh, colors. Don't remember what color we had, so we're just going to try. Oh, it was yellow. It was yellow. I remember that. <laughs> this is mostly just better I have a good memory here. Not, not even testing my English skills, just testing my memory skills. But don't worry, as soon as we get over this one, it's gonna be fine. Now, there will be some special pyramids where it's like all one category. So, we're gonna have to see those later. Hopefully we'll get some good categories. And yeah, you can see me sort of using up my energy over here. Here on the right top, we've got our gold. A job application. This one was strange. Like the answer to this, wasn't it a note? It was a name. It was a name. How is a job application a name? That that I don't I don't understand. But that's weird. Like that's not a job application. <laughs> also, job application is such a weird category. Like, is this supposed to be like a type of jobs, or what is that supposed to be? Astronomy. Nice Off we one. go. All right. Well, let's move. Now that you're officially convinced that I'm a seer and I can see the future, <laughs> let's go to the next one. <laughs> yeah, you can yeah, see this is all turning into money for me. In San Rito. Now, I really like the abilities. I'm excited to show them off to you as soon as we get. Now, every time we finish um, a thing, we're going to have a bit of a reveal here. So let's see how far we can get and how many things we can reveal. And also click here on the rewards and you can see what kind of achievements we got. So we got a 1-2 combo, 3x combo, 4x combo, 5x combo, 6x combo. Oh, okay, I clicked that too soon. We also got a stone of afterlight successfully used. Oh, uh, actually we haven't used that yet. Oh yes, the stone is this, this thing on the bottom, the one when you guess the whole world. Okay, now let's begin the proper game. So we have our first ability here, hmm, really Array of Gods, and it will really reveal the letter that you choose. So for example, here we get a B, we need a vehicle that starts with a B. Now let's just try some vowels. And every time we get the Stone of Afterlight right, so every time we guess the word, we gain extra point from this. Aha. I feel like it's something with a boss now. 
Something with a vehicle. Okay. Let's try a couple more vowels. Okay, there are no more vowels. Okay, we tried an A. Interesting. A vehicle. Bulldozer. Okay, okay. That's, that's pretty cool. Sometimes the categories are very like free. Like for example, for a category beach, you can get an answer vacation. So it's more like word association. Okay, musical instruments. Okay. Let's try a couple more vowels. Ah, oh, not gonna be any more vowels. So we'll try some of the other letters first. Interesting. Trying to figure out like what's a musical instrument that sounds like this. Wow. Um. <laughs> I'm sure many of you already know the answer, but English is not my first language, so sometimes it can be a bit difficult. I wasn't really sure if I should make a video for this game, but when I did it in my test game, I was actually pretty good at it. But now, <laughs> when we're doing it like live, it doesn't seem to go so well for me. Irregular verbs. That's not gonna. That's not a very helpful category to like teach me things. Okay. I, I need to like. Oh, forgive. Okay. Um, okay. One thing I forgot is like even if it's just one letter, you should be get using the stone of afterlife just so we can get the points. Okay, fruits. Fruits seems like a good category. There are no, almost no wows in this fruit. I know I heard an F like a lot of fruits types in an F or something. Some sort of a berry. No, not a berry because we don't have a B. Cherry. Sure. Okay, that's gonna give us some points. That's two letters. This persists between games, I believe? So we can use it like in the next pyramid, we could still like use this to learn things about ourselves. A boat. So the things with the boat seems to be like very freely associated, so... I'm assuming an R? Like fairy or something? Yeah, we'll do a fairy. I didn't want to guess the fairy immediately, because if you get it wrong, you lose some points. Alright, so now we've got one of these, so next time we get stuck, we can actually utilize it. It's gonna be good, but... Liquids. Not water. Not a drink, either. Okay... A liquid that starts with an S. No, sauce has too many words. Soup! Okay. Okay. That, that, that was pretty good. Not bad. So, the, I, and I can never decide whether, like, like, obviously, when you have fewer letters, it's easier. But it also means that if you really, like, do not have a clue, you can have a lot of, of, like, you can use up a lot of letters that will never give you anything. A house for three letters. I'm assuming something like a bed? No. Because it can be like anything in a house. I'm just gonna try some of these. The only thing I think of is a pen. Pen has nothing to do with the house, so... Pet? Could I have a pet in the house? Yeah, okay. See, see, the word association is a bit like... What? But we did still get some points with our energy, so we didn't do too terribly. And we're gonna reveal the next part of this. And... Hopefully we do better in the next one. What? Yeah. So this one, so one more, and then the next one is going to be all one category, which I think is actually going to be a bit easier maybe Another for us. Alright, so Justice Horn, it shows you all the vowels, which is quite cool. And now you've got theater and show. Okay, let's try. Here we go. Hmm. Be an L. Nice one. Melodrama. Yes. Okay, let's try with an M. 
R M Melodram. Yes, this is gonna give us a lot of points for this. Also, we got this pretty quickly, I think, so this might give us some extra points towards the second bonus as well. Computer and internet. Yes, this should be good. Or not. And that ends with an E. Let's just try some of the normal. Okay, well, that, that was a lot of also no bonuses. R T? Hmm. You see? Typeface. Yeah, yeah, typeface. So let's try. Yeah, is it gonna be typeface? I'm gonna try this. Not 100% sure. Aha. Okay. <laughs> I was like, maybe, maybe that's not quite what I think it is. I don't know. Baseball. Okay, I know nothing about baseball. Where I'm from, in Europe, we just care about soccer and also sometimes hockey, but mostly soccer, you know, so... Also sometimes basketball, but mostly soccer. Uni... Uni something. Say B. No, okay. How about an L? Uniform! Okay, well that didn't have too much to do with, with baseball. Okay, okay, that's fine, that's fine. We got it. We're good, we're good. Yeah, so baseball. Don't know many rules there. Adjectives for people. Okay. Let's try some of these. I'm not really think it needs to have. Well, it probably should have some more vowels, but... Not sure, actually. Hmm. Objectives for people. Do you want to? Let's reveal the last word. Crafty. Yeah, I, I, I wasn't gonna guess this one because I wasn't sure. I was like maybe, and I don't. I didn't want to guess this one. A circus and a carnival. Well, that's an interesting option. Something like, no, it can't be singing, because it's not... Circus and Carnival. Sting. Okay, it's gonna be a sting. Now... A swing, then. I wasn't sure how either sting or swing is related to circus, but swing makes more sense. We're gonna be swinging the circus, but yeah, like, I don't know if I said that already, but the categories are a bit... Like, how is that a... Here, okay, uh, an animal that has a U. There are gonna be probably no more vowels here, so let me just try. Bull. No, not bull. Do, pull, none of these are animals. Um, what is that gonna be? None of these are animals. I'm just gonna tell, let to tell me, I don't know. A gull. Okay. What animal is that? A container. A box. Are we gonna straight up guess? I'm gonna try. Box. Please don't let it be wrong. Please. Mm. No! Oh man. Okay. A beach. I feel like it should be a sun. No. Uh, do we want a reveal? Maybe we'll do a reveal. Fun. No, not fun. Because we already use the U. Okay. Fix. Fit. No. You're like you're fit at the beach. I don't know. <laughs> 
You're always fit at the beach, but... Thin. Okay. I mean, we made it yeah, through. Did it. Some obstacles. We made it. Here we can see a scorpion here, but not much else. But now this one, this one is all just one category. So let's really hope we get a good category. Otherwise, this is gonna be difficult. <laughs> Another one. Let's Animals. Those are cool. Okay, that's that's not a bad category for me. This anim animal has like no wowls. Like, what animal is that? Me? Hmm. Kinda hoping we could get the guess this animal pretty early on, but. Night. Tack? No? Nighthawk. Okay, I would have never guessed that. That's that's okay. That's just I'm just gonna make it through. No more commenting on that one. Come on, give give me something I can guess from. Fish, goldfish, gold goldfish. Goldfish. All right, all right. This is pretty. This went pretty well. Splendid. I'm gonna get some nice points here towards the both of our bonuses. All right. I think. Do you think in there is still gonna be any? I'm gonna try it, but it doesn't have any. Okay. And maybe. G now. Dolphin. Okay. Okay, that, that was okay. Wow. Nighthawk, goldfish, and dolphin. <laughs> Sounds like a start of some sort of a joke. B. No, it can't be. B. Beaver. I think a beaver, maybe? Maybe something else, but we'll try. Wow! Yes. Okay, okay. This is good. I like to have some options so that when we get stuck next time, we can get this. How about this? Let's try some of these other ones. An M, maybe? Bison? Is that how you read it? I could have guessed it, but I wasn't sure, so I was like, I'm just gonna try to be and on, on, on see later. But you do get the quick time bonus at least, which is nice. B, no, B, B. Now it show me the first letter. Moth? Could it be a moth? It can't. Um. More? Okay, okay. Just one more. A three-letter animal. I feel like I should just try to like... Three-letter animal. Ape. An ape? Yes. Alright, we got some quick time. Good, so our... Horn here is ready for next time. Now, uh, you also noticed uh, maybe that it said here no mistakes. So I think the no mistake might be something that gives us some of the further bonuses. So let's try to do one more. And we'll see. I do like those that are just like single category because if you can just like focus on the category, you can kind of, you know, focus your brain on just here one thing. Go. 
Toad Spear, okay? Five incorrect letters have been discovered. Make combos to get more artifacts of this type. Interesting. That's actually pretty cool. I do like that. Flowers and herbs. Nice one. <laughs> it's like it's gonna think like, hey, you're gonna guess this. Flowers, herbs, and shrubs. An S. We get so many combos, but I have no idea what goes inside. B. No. Narcissus. Okay. <laughs> In fact, it's just like the first half of the word, just like narcissist and <laughs> just the sources. Oh, military. Okay, soldier. S O L D I E. No. Too many. Too many soldiers, unless it's like multiple S's. No, it's not even a soldier. Okay. How about something like a weapon? It's just gonna go with the normal mouse. Military starts with an A. Admiral. No. Okay. I'm trying. Give me some more... Aid? Some sort of an aid? Aircraft! Okay. Aircraft. Right? That's gonna be it. Yes. We did not get points for quick time, unfortunately. A sport. Okay, we'll start an L. Okay, this is a bit of a race, but it's kind of hoping we end with the ball. It's not. Uh, let me, uh, tell me the wrong letters, maybe. Try to get more combos this way. Interesting. A sport. No. I'm gonna say Olympics. Cycling. Okay. Cycling. It can also be thought like, do I get a combo? No, I do not get a combo for guessing the word. So sometimes you might wanna, instead of guess the word, you might wanna try for the NNG like combo to gain some points for the true spear. Human body, okay. Certainly not blood. <laughs> this is what I get from all the violent games I play. <laughs> Ends with an E and R. Human body. Uh, tell me the first letter. Finger! So now do we want to do the combo or do we want to do the guessing thing? Let's do a combo. Give us a little bit. A farm. I'm gonna try to guess something like a harvest, but no. Maybe an S. Field. Field, okay. Nice one. Yeah. Just guessing three words is gonna give us a lot for this first option, so I think it's better often trying the combo. A camping. A tent? No. Fire. Also no. Not a fire, but it starts with an E and I and an E. Uh, this is kind of pointless. We don't need the horn here. That wouldn't help us. Bike? Hike. Okay. Okay, okay. Go camping, go hiking. I see, I see. Computer and internet web. Yes. We're gonna guess this immediately. Yeah, <laughs> this was a good one. Nice one. I'll try to do one more, I think. Yeah, we get a lot of gold from this one as well. Now let's continue. Seems like this category is movies, and I'm terrible at movies, so <laughs> I'm probably gonna end the episode right before that. <laughs> Really interesting. A boat. We just keep having boat as a category. Potion of time became available. Click on it. What does that do? 
makes time travel and chooses another word for guessing. Solve word without mistakes. Alright, so now we get something else. That's actually not bad. A combo, a job application. Nice one. Okay, there are gonna be no more vowels, so we can just like try other things. Policeman! Okay, okay. Policeman. Yeah, yeah. I see you. Let's go. Give me a lot of points, policeman. Uh, uh, not as many points as I was hoping. A dessert. Okay. Interesting. Interesting dessert. Dough. Donut. Let's actually, since we already kind of went for it, we're just gonna try to get a lot of combos, which is gonna give us a point for this thrill sphere. Which, what does it do again? Discovers five incorrect letters. Yeah, let's do that. Incorrect letters for fruits. Okay, we'll try E. I was gonna hope, kind of hoping we get a combo here. A fruit. Uh, show me one more letter. Avocado. A combo or a guess? We'll just do a guess. Once you get enough of the bonuses, it's getting a little bit easier. Also, it helps that it's a category that I know words in. <laughs> it's like, yeah. Jobs and occupation again. Okay. Uh, I'm not, I meant to click on an A, but I click on an B instead. Hmm. No idea. Let's just get a point here. D. Driver! Okay. More points for the throw sphere. Visual art. Movie. M? No. I mean, the M is there, it's just not movie. I guess we'll go with the vowels then. Come on, we gotta figure this out. Visual art. Do you know? That was wrong. Um. Come on. I feel like you're screaming it at me. Mage. Visual art. Image! Oh, this was such a fail. Were you screaming it at me? Oh, man. <laughs> no, no famous actors. I hate that. Because <laughs> I don't know any actors. <laughs> this is just gonna be the worst. We need to have, like, a, some sort of letter. Oh, and there's nothing useful here. What happens if I use the truth sphere twice? Oh, it does block more letters. Okay. Oh, okay, John, that, that was... I could have guessed that, but you know. Family, a son? No. A dad? Mom? With an O, right? It can also be with a U. Oh, it's just an O, okay. It's... <laughs> there are a lot of different ways to say mom in a lot of different languages. <laughs> well, I was like, and you can say mom with the U in English. It's fine. It's not the most grammatically correct version, but it's fine. Could have been. Come on. Come on. You know it could have been an answer. Did we do the movies? They want to watch me utterly fail at movies. I'm gonna click on it just for you. Oh, this is something else. A manuscript game where your goal is to recreate the original word from the jumbled letters. Okay. Time, obviously. 
Now please enter it by yourself. Excellent. Continue and earn. Guess as many words as you can before the time runs out. Face. This is better. I'm better at this. More? Is that a word? Oh, room. Okay, okay, sorry. Sorry, that was, that was on me. Can we like fail three times? Hand? See, I'm awesome at this part. Should have done this from the beginning. If this was the only mode in the game, you would have rocked this game. Help, yeah, help me. Like, it's just like, you can do it in two seconds. Moon. Yep. How many points I've got? I'm gonna have so many combos. Love. Easy peasy. Girl. Come on, let's do a competition if you're gonna be faster than me. Okay, I see you're faster than me. <laughs> okay, that was just, you know, I was giving you some, you know, points so that we could handicap, so that we could be equal in the game, because I'm obviously better than this. What? Eight? No. It's not eight. No. How oh, is this idea? Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, I see when we're doing a competition, you're clearly winning. And we're not doing a competition like right now. I'm clearly winning, okay? It's just, I don't want to make you feel bad about losing against me, okay? So when it's a competition, I tend to kind of... See, now I'm good at it again, but it's like, as soon as it's a competition. I want to skip to the one minute mark. We're gonna do another competition and see not if I bad. fail every time it's a competition or not. Right? Okay. Okay, get ready. In four seconds. Barn. Okay, okay. Now, now it's a competition again. Let's see. Tight. Diet. How is it not a diet? It's not tied or diet. Well, as soon as it's a competition, I'm completely like my brain is like, no, it's a competition, I'm easy to lose. What? what? How is it tied and not a diet? Neither one of those is true. Teddy, Detty, none of that means anything. Edit. Um, and I do anything, obviously. I'm gonna do anything right after this. Oh, that's such a big fail. But that was a really cool mode. I love that mode. Look at that. Take a break from work and play a nice jigsaw puzzle mini game. Sure, let's do a jigsaw puzzle mini game. Oh. Yeah, maybe. <laughs> this is gonna take us forever. Um. Yeah, I think we're just gonna end the episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, run down the comments and you can click on the right to watch some other puzzle games that I played on this channel. I'll see you there. Bye bye!